we've often talked about the power of a pet, particularly dogs. They just have this way about them that they can put a smile on your face, particularly if you've had a one of those days. One of those in the past, we have shared stories of therapy dogs going into senior living homes and libraries, brightening the day of anybody who has interaction with them. So what would happen if you placed a therapy dog inside a high school? <laughs> a lot, actually. <laughs> As a matter of fact, this guy right here simply put his changing lives at Pocomoke High School. This is Rudy. We'd also like to introduce to you Rudy's human. This is Jesse Bova, <laughs> and principal in that Wallace, Maryland's High School Principal of the Year at Pocomo. Glad to have you guys Thanks with for us joining today. Us Thank you. Good afternoon. So tell us a little bit, Jesse, about Rudy. So Rudy is a seven-year-old golden retriever. He started off as my foster dog, and I fostered him through a golden retriever rescue called Great, and then ended up adopting him. Yeah, I can see why. <laughs> now, he is a uh, trained therapy dog. Mm -hmm. What does that mean? So he's certified through Pets on Wheels of Delmarva, and in order to do that, they do a temperament test and an observation of him. Um, ours was actually at the, the Berlin Nursing Home, but um, he's able to go to the library and the schools in the area in the nursing home. And, and Rudy spends a lot of time at Pocomoke High School. He does. He comes to work with me every day. <laughs> what does he do there? Rudy does a lot of stuff there. He um, visits with students. Um, I'm a school counselor there. Yeah. So he's kind of an extension of our counseling department. <laughs> I look at him. He has his own group of students that request to come see him specifically. And um, he visits classrooms and kind of during transition times is present just Brightening the mood. Right. Yeah. yeah. So it's the principal office when necessary. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> so Annette, tell us about how he has impacted students' lives. You know, I, I think I shared before, a, a large portion of our students, probably about 75% come from homes of poverty. Um, mm -hmm. And so for some of them, Rudy just provides a normalcy that they really don't have in their lives. Um, and a lot of students don't have a pet at home, and so it also not only provides therapy as far as comfort but um, relaxation, but it also provides like responsibility, uh, and so students enjoy that. My goodness. All right, so tell us about some of these pictures that we're seeing. <laughs> well, that's just Rudy being cute. Yeah. <laughs> He's being adorable there. That's him in his Pets on Wheels bandana. Now what's going on here? He's in front of a microphone. Oh, he's a celebrity. He's um, on the morning announcements at school. Oh my goodness. <laughs> he's got his tie on. <laughs> oh, <laughs> and there he is. Oh, <laughs> that's one of his window? favorite spots. That's the attendance office, and so she keeps treats for him there, so he visits and oh. checks in. Mm -hmm. Oh my goodness. Multiple times a day. Yes. <laughs> so it's, it's, it's easy to see the, how the kids can form a bond with him. Absolutely. You see that? Absolutely. So, yeah. okay, so tell us, Rudy is in the running for a big honor. Yes. Tell us about this. What's, what's the deal? He is in a contest right now for Therapy Dogs. It's a national contest through Pets Best Health Insurance. Yeah. And um, it's all Facebook vote, um, based, so you can vote on Facebook. Uh -huh. But if he wins, our school gets $1,000, and we also get $500 toward an animal nonprofit. He's in the lead right now. So. Really? Oh. We're winning by a lot. Well, we need to stretch that lead out. Yeah, mm -hmm. we need to keep him there. So how can the community help? Uh, you can vote on Facebook through Pets Best Health Insurance. If you go to their page, there's a link to the contest. Okay. It's also on our school Facebook page as well. Mm -hmm. so. And yeah. it ends here pretty school. soon, doesn't it? It ends tonight at midnight. Oh, oh my so, goodness. Yes. Yeah. So you have today. time yeah. to mm -hmm. do it. And of course, we're going to give you all that information on our website. So. It's in the meantime, hard to keep your hand off of him. <laughs> yeah, it is. It is, and I think he likes it that way. Can hey, we baby. perhaps borrow him for our office? <laughs> Absolutely. Can we sure, rent him? I'd be willing to rent him. That'd be okay. <laughs> that would be a great school fundraiser idea. Yeah, oh, give me a little, little idea. A little bit. <laughs> All right, Jesse. Rudy, you do a good job. Who gets to evaluate Rudy's job at the end of the year? Uh, his mother and I will. Okay. Oh boy. So how's he done so far? Any need for improvement here? I, I'm going to give him an A plus yeah? in all okay. categories. <laughs> Absolutely. I am too. You're doing good, Rudy. All right. Doing Annette, Jesse, Rudy, <laughs> thank you so much thank for coming oh, in oh, sorry. today. I Best don't know of what luck. I, was <laughs> I know. You sorry. can't stop now. And if you want to read more about Rudy and find out how you can vote for Rudy, just go to our website, domarvalife.com.